the channel. Welcome if you are new. For those of you that are new, my name is Anna and this is At Home with Anna. If you are new, we just moved into our brand new home here in Tennessee and we are so happy to be here, you guys. We are enjoying every single second. But <laughs> it's a lot of work. So um, I'm not going to be purposely showing you guys the kitchen and the living room and the dining room because I've got a lot going on there that I want to save for future videos. Today we're going to be concentrating on the office. I've got lots of odds, 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 <laughs> lots of odds and ends in there that I need to um, to deal with. I need to get my office set up because it is. Um, you know, the hub of, of my home. And, you know, I've got mail coming in. I don't have a permanent place for it. I don't have no system set up yet. And so I really want to get that done. Um, we did get a new paper shredder, um, which we got for free, which was awesome. And um, I got a new printer and yeah. So I want to go get um, a new rug for in there. And so I might be doing that um, in this video. I'm not sure. It just really depends on where I end up um, here in just a little bit. But uh, it's really important to me that I get the office set up. So um, hopefully you guys that are new and maybe clicking on this video for the first time will go back and watch um, a few video videos back <laughs> where I announced that we bought the home and then I packed and yeah, the whole thing. So um, the whole story is on YouTube. So um, anyways, I want to show you guys where we're at with the office and um, and then we'll go from there. So starting in, this is our entryway. You can see that I've already moved the table with the lamps from here. Um, because I had something here and it just was sticking out just a little too far. I wanted something smaller and sleeker, so I'm going to be keeping my eye out for that, but it's not something that I need today. Of course, shoes, <laughs> the whole situation, um, you know, the weather. We keep coats out here because you never know <laughs> if you're going to need a coat or a sweater or what the deal is. But I have all this kind of stuff. So this is stuff that came from the last house that I packed and it was just like vitamins and junk drawer stuff and that kind of thing. Here is the office. You can see I have stuff everywhere. This is all that weird stuff that you just don't know what to do with um, when you move. And I am determined to find a home for it. All of the office-y kind of stuff is going to be going into that piece of furniture there. Um, I need to go through this. Um, found our marriage license and all that kind of stuff is in here. Um, so I need to find a home for this. This is a shredder that we got for free and my printer, the whole cord situation, before I get started, I need to decide how I'm gonna, if I'm gonna leave. Now, I don't wanna get rid of this. I love this chandelier. This is meant to be a dining room, which I'm using as an office. Um, so it makes sense to me to have the desk right underneath the lamp or the chandelier, excuse me. Um, eventually, that whole back wall is going to be cabinetry and I'm just not sure how long it's going to take before we get to that. I'm trying to zoom, not zoom in, but make it more clear. But um, I want like cabinets and then a step down for a desk so that I can have a writing desk here still, but my computer will sit back there. So, you know, step down into a desk and then, um, you know, more cabinetry. So everything will have a permanent home. I want like built-in file cabinets, that whole thing, but that is not a priority right now. So um, I'm working with what I have and I want it to be pretty. So just to get me up and going so I could get you guys the last few videos, um, we have the computer plugged in here because everything's a three prong, but I really want to put this guy inside the cabinet but there's no hole back there so I might I don't know I don't know you guys I don't know what to do I might just move it over there for now until Ernie comes home and he can drill me the hole in the back so the cord can come out um, 
And then the cord for the computer, I want like this over there, and then I, might, I put a rug, and then the cord will go under the rug. Um, and that's really the only option that I have. I'm not a fan of using walls to place furniture. I'm just not. I don't think that anybody should be a fan of that. I think that you should use your entire space and be creative with it. And that's what I plan on doing here. <laughs> Had I built this home from scratch, I would have known that and I would have had like outlets in the floor, that kind of thing, but I don't. So I gotta work with what I have. So my goal for today and in this video is to get this office done and get it looking good. And um, another thing really quick that I like <laughs> is from the exterior of a home, I love when you look in a home and you see lighting. I love lamps. Any kind of lamps that you can put anywhere in your home as an element of lighting, um, you know, that's not overhead, um, not chandeliers, not can lighting. If you can add lamps in rooms, it just adds such a warm element and an inviting element to a space. So. I love having the lamps back here. It just looks so good from out in the front of the house. <laughs> so good. So anywho, okay. So this is the room that we are going to be working on. I'm going to have to go through everything I've got. I need to figure out permanent homes for everything. Where do I want my batteries? Where do I want my vitamins? I don't know. They're not going in the office. <laughs> I don't know where they're all going. So, uh, Anywho, um, we're going to get everything taken out of here that doesn't belong, and we're going to um, keep only what is supposed to be in here. I'm going to clean out the inside of that dresser or armoire or buffet, whatever you want to call it. Um, I have some decor on there I'm not loving. I don't know, maybe we'll see. I held back a couple pieces from upstairs I might be using. I don't know. We shall see. That's the beauty of decor. You get to play and just have fun with it. Um, but yeah. So today is not the end all be all of the decor of the office, but here is our before of what the office looks like now. And we are going to get started. Oh, the joy of all the little items that um, are a nuisance in a move. <laughs> it's so important to me to get this office done because, like I said, it is the hub of the home. Um, and if I continue to bring mail in, you know, and that kind of stuff, and I don't really have a place for it, then it's just going to continue to pile up. So I really wanted to just get this situated today and... Um, you know, just make sense of the office. I wanted the office to look like an office um, by the time I was done. So um, I needed to go through paperwork that I brought with me from California. Um, and so I was just kind of making piles. You know, this is what goes in the garage. This is what um, that big stack is all of the um, pamphlets that come with, you know, new appliances and um, everything that we had bought new. So um, I definitely want to have those all in one spot. I need to sit down, um, and I haven't yet, but I need to sit down and register um, for everything, you know, the dishwasher, the stove, um, the microwave, um, all of those things, and make sure that um, I'm on record in case something goes wrong with them. Um, and so definitely want to make sure to do that. And then, you know, just make sure that I had like a spot for um, all of the, you know, extension cords and batteries. And I, and even though I put all of those items here in this hutch or buffet, um, this is not where they're going to live permanently. And I know that I said I was being methodical about that. However, I did decide where they're going to go. So at least they're organized. And when I get to the area, um, that I am going to put them, which is going to be in the closet um, that's here downstairs. Excuse me. Um, I'm going to uh, get some a little bookshelf to put in there and shelving system type thing with some baskets, and that's going to house 
all the batteries and one, all the extension cords and another, and our first aid kit and another, and that type of thing. So I'm not quite there yet, but at least I got it organized inside this area. So when I do finally get that bookcase and baskets, I'll be able to move it over there. So at least I know that it's, you know, cleaned out, organized, and ready to just be stored in its permanent home. So I have to take this <laughs> room by room. I have to go room by room on all of these projects. Um, I, I promise you the next video is going to be the pretty stuff, um, but I wanted to take you guys along with me for the process from moving in to setting up house and just kind of, you know, this is what it looks like when you move, you know. Everything's not perfect and beautiful all at once. <laughs> um, it's actually the first home that I've ever moved into to where I didn't have it pretty, like within the first 48 hours. And let me explain that. <laughs> I typically will just set up house and I mean hang pictures and, you know, decorate surfaces and, you know, all of those things. Within the first 48 hours, I'm going to be moved in, you know. 72 hours goes by and I want to, I want it to look like I've lived there for a while. So I bust my butt usually when I move to do that. Um, and I know I had said I was waiting for Ernie really quick, but I am so proud of myself and so was he. <laughs> I went to Home Depot um, after I filmed the intro and I got this little hole thingy because I was determined to get it done and it was super easy and I was so proud of myself that I got, <clears throat> I got this done and I didn't need his help. Um, so, uh, anyways, I am taking my time, um, like I said, to get things done because I want to make sure that I don't have to move things around a lot other than what I said I'm putting in this hatch that will go in that closet, but at least I know it's contained in a area, you know, in an area and it's organized in that area so that when I do get its permanent home set up, I can just move it over there. But as far as everything else goes, I'm being pretty, pretty methodical um, about, uh, you know, how I'm doing things. The office um, is, like I said, probably on numerous occasions, not the end all be all. Um, this is just to get me through like a year and um, I don't even finish it in today's video. I'm going to be adding to it, of course. Um, that's what we do. Um, but at least when you walk in, it doesn't look like a storage room anymore. <laughs> it looks like an actual office. Um, you know, I can't wait to get the cabinetry done and get a proper desk and, um, you know, get it wallpapered and all of those things. But... Um, I'm not going to waste my time on doing that kind of stuff right now when it's only, well, maybe the wallpaper, you know, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not at the wallpaper stage yet, but maybe the wallpaper, we shall see, but, uh, either way, I'm going to go ahead and put some music on, I'll let you guys enjoy, um, the motivation.
morning guys it is another day as you could tell I've got laundry going I woke up at 5 30 this morning because I'm very excited about a delivery that's coming today um, it's supposed to be here between 7 and 10 a.m. so very excited about that but um, we left off with kind of you know getting the office kind of put together and um, today I want to concentrate on adding some decor to it um, so we're going to be doing that and then I got an ironing board I think I mentioned in one of the last videos that I couldn't find an ironing board to save my life so I had to order one on uh, Amazon and it finally came yesterday so I have some ironing to do I have napkins that need to get ironed and put away um, and they're very linty, <laughs> the gray ones are, so I need to get those um, rectified before I can put them away. Um, and yeah, so we're just going to kind of spend the rest of the video um, doing that, but mainly the office. I want to make sure to get that done. So it's a very cold morning. We woke up to, you know, frost on the grass and the rooftops and and all of that but I love it anyways that is what we are going to try and accomplish today in the rest of the video I'm kind of stumped with um, just because I know that this isn't the way the office is gonna be it probably will for at least the next year just because we have so much so many so many other things that we want to get done um, that cost money <laughs> so um, this will probably you know have to be this way for a year um, so I, I really want to make it a place that is pretty and um, you know looks good um, for that year so I'm gonna try my hardest to accomplish that but anyways uh, that is what we are doing today so so let's go ahead and get started hey, Lord. counter. Oh, what is that? Oh, well, it came with an extra Sure did. It came with an extra cover. Nice. Is this an extra cover? What is this? I suppose directions. What is that? What is this extra one for? I do not know. Well, it doesn't say. I don't know. If you guys know what this is, <laughs> let me know in the comments. So my delivery, it's from Wayfair, but and they leave outside the door. And then you have to bring everything in unless you want to pay two hundred dollars or a hundred something dollars and i'm like no thank you i will save the <laughs> extra money and drag it in myself so they just called and said they're on their way so yay i'm so excited about this delivery you guys but you guys don't get to see it yet so excited Oh, 
15 months while we're building. Oh my gosh, that's right. And uh, I just got my table delivered. And we are, we are, oh, I've been fighting. Uh, I, I, I've done this for 50 years, so that I, uh, uh, I started, we started buying stuff in April. It's been several hours since I last picked up the camera. <laughs> That meeting with the window treatment guy went really well. He is um, such a great storyteller. Uh, super fast appointment turned into three and a half hours. And um, he was a wealth of information and I just really enjoyed our visit together. So I did end up ordering shutters for the entire downstairs and those will be in in about four weeks. So. Yay, excited about that. Um, and then you guys saw I got my dining room set or my dining room table. I had to have a neighbor come help me. It was so heavy. And um, thank you, Jesus, for her because I was at a, I was at a loss. My son's working and I, you just never know what the weather here. Although it's really clear, but I just wasn't sure <laughs> how I was going to get that in. And anyways... I got it in and all is well. So it's been several hours and I'm on a, um, a time clock here because I my goal is, is each time Ernie comes home, I want to accomplish things that make the house home um, so that, you know, it's a surprise for him. And so I'm trying to stay on a schedule for that um, and allowing myself days to go out and explore and shop and, and all of those things. So um, today was the day I was supposed to pull this offer to this offer, this office together. Um, so I do have a piece of artwork that I want to hang on this wall. I'm going to show it to you guys. It's right here. And um, I bought this, oh my gosh, so long ago. And um, it has all of the colors in my house that I'm doing. The, every single color in here is my color scheme for the house. And this wall, you can see directly from the front door when you walk in. So I thought how nice it would be to just kind of introduce the color palette immediately when you walk in the front door. And so I think this piece of art will work. Um, it's not huge. Um, I think it's just the right size. I'm hoping it doesn't get lost on the wall. I think that it's the perfect, perfect size for the wall. Um, and it also allows me some room on either side so if I decide to hang um, sconces or something like that. Remember, this office is only temporary the way I'm decorating it for the next you know, year or so because there's other things that we want to do in here. So I'm just trying to make it pretty and comfortable um, while it's in this state. And so, um, but this picture I think will probably stay in, in this room no matter what we end up doing. So um, there's this. I have some other choices. So I'm going to go grab those and I'm going to see how I like them. But I'm really thinking that this one is the one. The only, like I said, um, thing is I, I'm just hoping the wall doesn't swallow it. This isn't a very large wall. Um, but it is nice to leave something on either side of the picture so that, like I said, sconces or something can go up there. So we'll see. But um, I'm going to go grab a couple more pieces and just see if I like them. And we'll go from there. Okay. I decided this is the one that I want. The other ones are, the colors are too, um, they're not the colors that I'm going for. So I'm going to stick with my initial, my initial thought process. Okay, this area is an area that I want to, I 
thick layer. later in the day. <laughs> I had to stop. You might have noticed that my nail color changed in the middle of ironing and maybe my clothes because I had to stop and go get my hair done and my nails done. I had appointments. So I just came home, finished ironing, um, and that is going to do it for today's video. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Make sure to come back um, to see all the updates I'm going to be doing in the office. Like I said, this is not the end-all be-all. I am looking for some plants for in there. I have not found any. I'm going to go look again tomorrow uh, to see if I can find anything for in there. But I want big, <laughs> and I'm not finding big. And I don't want fiddle fig leaf. It's not my jam anymore. So anyways, there's lots of updates that I want to do in there. Excuse the laundry room. I've got, laundry. I've got the stuff everywhere, but, you know, I'm going to get to it. I'm going to get to it. Um, but anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you haven't subscribed, I hope you plan on doing that before you leave today. I would love to have you join my little community here on YouTube. 
I love to do homemaking, all things homemaking. I love to do decorating and cooking and just all of the things, cleaning and organizing, and I have a lot of all that coming up. Click subscribe before you leave today and make sure to click that little bell notification, guys. Some of my subscribers, even my longtime subscribers, have not clicked that bell. If you click that bell, every time I upload a video, YouTube says, hey, Anna just uploaded a video, and you guys will know. So you won't miss another video. I hope that you guys have a fantastic rest of your weekend, and we will see you guys in the next video. Bye! Bye.